Good evening, I am Zmaven of the Eventide. Welcome back to another Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines playthrough. Colon Masquerade. I don't know. I got nothing. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you doing today, Paul? I have no idea what we're doing. I've forgotten everything. Today is Thanksgiving. So, happy Thanksgiving from the past. Mm -hmm. You're probably listening to this mid-December because most of you are not my Patreon patrons and are not hearing this until I make it public. And if you're not, what's wrong with you? Yeah! Join Patreon! Join the madness. Okay, so last time we played, we talked about possibly switching these videos to streams and asked you guys what you thought and you all gave us some feedback. And uh, the big question was if we streamed would we also then still put the videos on youtube for you to watch later if you can well, catch the stream. stream on youtube so yeah and the stream is safe there exactly so video. if you don't want to watch a stream don't worry the video that we stream will then become a video on youtube and you can watch it just like you watch these videos the main difference would be that i wouldn't be able to edit them so um there I probably mean, be can like you can take the output and then re-upload it or something but then you lose all like the cool like, I think you can see the comments that happen yeah, in the, real time. Yeah, the live chat. And, um, the point of the stream would be that we could be responding to whoever is watching the stream in real time. If someone gives us advice, we could, like, make a choice based on what the chat says. And you says. don't want to edit out the magic. Yeah. So um, that might make the videos less tight, but overall they'd be pretty much the same. Yeah, because we we are they're super tight as they are. Oh, yeah. Know? I mean, the stuff I edit out... Tightly edited. ...is just me being a perfectionist. Um <laughs> Is it like do you? Because I don't, I don't. I just watch the highlights of some of the videos. Like I'll skim through them. Do you actually edit out like when we're just traipsing through the city, like yeah, if we're for long not, periods of time, if we're not and then we're just talking, like we're audibly like, let's edit this out. It's like no, let's keep it. They want to see us rambling. It's like if if we're being funny, I leave it. If we're not being funny, I edit it. All right, I'm gonna purposely start saying really unfunny stuff like I do normally during these <laughs> long periods. So you have no choice but to edit out the boring parts. Why? Why do you make my life hard? <laughs> oh, oh! I edit out if if um, we get interrupted while we're recording. I edit out if you sneeze into the microphone. I don't do that. I'm a professional. I edit out if we have to, like, take a long pause to drink some wine. Mm. Yeah. Well, usually we do that during the playthrough, so we don't have to pause very much. Mm, well, I'm drinking wine right now. I wanted to, like, start picking up with my character and, like, catch up to where we were. Just so I could have you which know, character fun. your Gwen my, True the Ventru? No, or your, Gwen, Gwen True she's a one off. Uh, your uh, Gangrel character. My Gangrel's the the main guy. I forgot what his name was. You don't even remember. Where is he? Is he on here? Did you name him? Uh, lasers. No, lasers. No, oh, no, that's when we were uh, fighting the lasers. Where is he? I don't know. It's been a while since I had a chance to play my game, so it's probably way down. No, it it was in here. This is going back to last December. Hmm. Well, you should save with more discernible titles, otherwise you'll never find your game. Speaking of games, so we held a poll. Mm. And on the poll, I asked you guys which of our many options we should do next. And uh, there was 111 votes on our poll of the whatever 2,500 of you that watched this video. And those 111 votes of 60 something of them i voted gargoyle what did what one it's more than half of them voted that we go to the santa monica pier and uh find this julius guy so that's what we're gonna do because the eyes have it i wanted to do the gargoyles uh, we will do the gargoyle however someone advised us that oh i can only get in on the side that i'm not supposed to get in on advise us that um, we need one more point in persuasion or something to truly do the route that I want to do with the gargoyle is to try to like befriend him befriend the gargoyles as opposed to fighting him or like convince him to work with the vampires wait or... who's him the gargoyle What's can that? we talk to the gargoyle yes and okay. I want the gargoyle to be my friend I just assumed that the gargoyles were like mindless like constructs uh, they're kind of like no i think what they are is they were vampires that got 
changed into monsters. Not that vampires aren't already monsters, but more monstery monsters by the Tremere, because the Tremere are. What, did I just walk around in a circle? No, oh, you're no, okay in the right way. way. It's been so long since I've been to Santa Monica. All right, so we are going to see this Julius guy because he talked his big mouth and told a screenwriter about the true vampires. The screenwriter was going to put that in a movie. It was going to be all over the media. Would have been bad. And um, I'm supposed to kill this guy. I still don't get how us giving the script to Vivi was getting rid of the script because surely he has backups. I guess Here's my good. only copy I keep with me. And I'm gonna let you, random stranger, borrow it. I guess that's Julius. Isn't that the guy who stutters? Like these pallet fire they got. Look, it's just like the fires you build all the time. Old yeah, pallets. Just too lazy to take them apart and just throw them all in. Oh, it is Julius. Yeah. What what what, what do, you, do you want? Uh, do you know David Hatter? No, 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 no. Have you been telling a mortal about us? Please, I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't, no, I, I didn't, I didn't mean, mean, mean I didn't oh, mean no, to. no, I don't want to kill I, this I guy. I feel uh, bad for him. You're doing him a favor. What I am, I, I, I didn't, I didn't know. Oh, do I have another option? I'm sorry, but there are consequences for exposing us to mortals. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, I hope one of the answers is, I know. <laughs> I'll never do it again. Julius, the punishment for talking is death. Oh, why am I such a stooge? No, 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 no. Oh, God, oh, God. They aren't my rules, you understand? Please, find your heart. Can I find my heart? I would like to find my heart. Is that an option? Sorry, it's six feet under somewhere. Mm. Just kill him. Huh. He's done nothing for us. He's not making a case. Hmm, I'm sorry, We were Julius. given orders. I wish there was another way. <laughs> you you could let me go. I, I, I promise. I, I, I would leave Los a Angeles. No loose I ends. Swear. No um, loose ends. I mean, considering the fact that he apparently didn't even realize he was running his mouth and giving the info to the screenwriter, he's probably going to do it again. Ignorance of the law is still. The yeah. Law. Uh. Hmm. I didn't know murder was illegal. Uh, hmm. This is like a this is like a non-issue for me. I'm just like you're dead. No, I'm too nice. I'm the nice favorite. Look at option number two. What's in it for me? Can I trade for something? What do you mean? What's in it for me? If, oh, if I do okay. let him yeah, go, right, go, give him a chance to make okay. a case. I don't know, Julius. I'd piss off a lot of people. What's in it for me? Uh, I, I don't. Much, I, 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 just some some uh, money, a uh, hundred bucks or so. I was hoping for like the secrets of the universe. A uh, hundred bucks. Hmm. Should I kill him? I, you're, you, I, you have my answer. Oh no! This is a moral dilemma. No, it's not. You're a vampire. Kill it. Well, look at him. He's such a sad little baby vampire. Uh, mm, I wish I had saved right before I'd done this and I can try one option, see what happens, and then try a different option. Well, my guess is that whatever whatever you pick, the option, it would come back to bite you like way later on. It's like, oh, by the way, they caught him running his mouth again. You did kill him, didn't you? Huh. But you know what? That's interesting. That's interesting. Uh, is it, though? It's also wrong. Murdering my fellow vampires is wrong. He's a thin blood. Or whatever. I am not a classist. Mm. No, no. This is the difference between the Toreador and whatever the hell you are. I, I'm not going to do it. All right. Give me what you got and get You're out of here. You're a town. terrible stooge. I'll see you again. It's over. <laughs> thank, thank, thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank Sold you. out. Remember you lost Julius. humanity for that? I guess because you... You took money to do so. Maybe. Remember, Julius, never come back in this lifetime. Leave immediately. I thought I'd gain humanity for helping him. Oh, see? I did. Okay, humanity so gained. Okay, so lost it and just got it back, so it's a zero sum. And I got XP. Hmm. I still say this is a terrible, terrible decision. It's an interesting decision. Interesting, I'm playing possibly. with fire. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Um, let's see what my quest log says. Uh, you allowed Hatter's collaborator Julius to flee town with the understanding he's never to return. You should inform Vivi that he's been taken care of. Ooh, I'm going to go lie to her. Hmm. However, we are in Santa Monica. And there was something with like a salvage company we needed to find. Where is this card? Brother Salvage. And that was our clue for the next part in- well, I think there was something in your quest log about it. Go back to your quest log. Oh, it just says you found a business card, but it's connected to the Carnival of Death thing. So yeah, so let's, let's go to Brother Salvage since we're here. And if you all think I'm an idiot for not offing this Julius guy... Oh, put a poll up there. Should I have done this? Was this a terrible mistake? Yay yeah, or just, yay? Just leave me a comment That's... and let me know why I'm an idiot. That's why I like polls, is because they can tell you, it's like, yes, you were an idiot, but you don't have to read 13, like, thousand hey, comments. comments are why. better for the algorithm. Oh, yeah. Gotta and game we, it. And we have to appease the YouTube gods. Like, comment, subscribe, join my Patreon, please, I'm begging you. God, I hate YouTube culture. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Uh, Brother Salvage, I think I know that where that is. It's like back where all the homeless people stay. Yeah, I think it's by it's where the big we, tank where the um, Yeah, guy where we lives. went in for that thing. Not that way. That's the prosthetics. Is there's not a shortcut through here? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that prosthetics place was super creepy. That and like the chanting zombies were the creepiest parts. Santa Monica's so dead compared to downtown. Downtown doesn't have much going on either, really. There's a few more lights around, but it's got exactly the same amount of people. Should I check my apartment while I'm here? See if I have any emails or anything? Yeah, can. Check my mailbox for random money and blood bags. Hmm. So how was your Thanksgiving, Paul? It was the same as yours. How was yours? <laughs> Pretty great. <laughs> I cooked a feast. You were there. In fact, you, you did the majority of the work, but I mean, I was a good sous chef. I did all the slicing and yeah, dicing. Yeah, you chopped all the onions. Oh, yeah. Those were so some really powerful onions, too. My gosh, those hurt. <sighs> Zero unread emails. Oh. Well, then never mind. Thankfully, through the magic of editing... <laughs> No? Nope, still here. Okay. Uh, all right. What's something really bad and boring I can tell so this gets edited out? Um, oh, gosh. I should bring that book of knock-knock jokes that Gravy makes me read all the time because uh, they're so bad. <laughs> Children's knock-knock like, knock jokes. Knock-knock. Who's there? Time for. Time for who? Time for bad. Oh, and Gray does laugh so. But then he just kind of retorts. It's like. Time for bed who? And it's like, no, no, this it's over. Not, we're on, we're on to the next one now, kid. <laughs> What's that other one he tells? They're all equally terrible. All right. Where is the bus stop? Because I do not remember my way around Santa Monica. Santa Monica it has been like too two blocks. long. Uh, just go through, yeah, go through there and then hang up. Or if, I don't know. <laughs> Some direction or other. Yeah. You got a 50-50 you got chance. Don't blow it. Left. Oh, right. It's around back behind the diner. That's right. It's this brother salvage. There it is. Wow, how'd they get that truck up there? Takes us closer to the time of oh, I miss you guys. Time of judgment gets closer every second. Wow, they shop at the same store. I have seen the mm, trespassers will be shot. Please don't shoot me. Am I going to get shot? You get shot all the time. It's not a combat zone. Is this going to be a combat zone? Maybe I should have saved before I came in here. Oh, oh. Yep, it's a combat zone. What kind of, uh, what, what member of the family was that? Uh, hold on. I was wondering why he was acting so flamboyant when you came in. It's like, is that a civilian acting all fl- No, no. Only a vampire could flounce, Wait, so. where's my, um... Okay, oh, the old trusty fire axe. Didn't we come to a conclusion about the fire axe? Well, we're going to use a katana because it's faster. It does less damage, but you can do less can damage faster, faster, so... No, he didn't go into the potty. 
<laughs> or parents, can you tell? Do you have to go potty, little swooshy vampire? Whoa. Oh, I thought those dogs were coming for it. It's like, no, don't kill that puppy. Don't make me kill the dog. Don't kill the little Rottweiler puppy and what is possibly a bulldog running here. Not a bulldog. Pitbull. That's the thing. Mm. Wow, it's huge. Well, let's get to murdering. All right, here we go. What? How? Uh. What happened to me? Did you step on a landmine or did something like physics collide with you that the game was not expecting? I have no idea. I honestly do not know. Well, let's try that again. Goodness gracious. Great balls of final death. Okay. I think we should be right on the other side of that door anyway. Right before we go into the combat zone? Well, I'm going to use celerity. Uh, We're back up here. Wait. Dang. All right. I thought we got going through those load zones. No, but again, through the magic of editing... <laughs> Um, that was see. the last load zone I went through. That's a crappy joke. Um, you floundering for crappy jokes is funny, so... No, man. All right. I'm able to sing a stupid song. I'm see. too tired. I had so much to eat today, and then we had to take the kids to the movies. Uh, and and I was, went the wrong way that again. Was a thing. Yeah, we saw Frozen 2 today. Sure did. Living on the edge. Living for that 90s power ballad, by the way. <laughs> Spoilers. There's no spoilers. I like how we sort of in the movie and then he just wasn't, and then it's like, oh, I'm here again, and let me let me do let me do the big thing at the most inopportune moment. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. I was I was kind of hoping that he and Ryder are just going to become a thing. So you yeah, to, I was like, oh, they introduced a new Ranger character. Too? I thought they were going to hook up. I or know. Something. I saw his eyes get all big. It's like, uh oh. But you know, platonic friendships are an important part of. Uh, children's media. Mm. Uh, all right. Yeah. I'm gonna get my katana out this time. Flounce, boom, diggity. Oh. Did I get him? Okay. Uh, well, I don't think you killed him, but I think he'll be very confused when he appears on the other end of wherever he is. Missing some limbs. Okay, let's save here. Well, I saved right right outside the door. Maybe he wasn't an enemy. All right, check to see if what you stepped on something. Might, I want to say that, I don't know. I don't see anything there. Did he just appear out of nowhere and... You know what? I'm going to use my discipline. Yeah, you just got, like, physics. that's all. Is that him? They're just teleporting all over the place. Jump on top. Jump, jump on top of those barrels. Get on top of the cars. Ugh. Stuck. Bloodlines. Oh, jumping puzzles. We... Okay. Maybe celerity wasn't the right choice. Whoa. Where'd they go? <laughs> uh... Okay. Alright, there must be... Oh, can we go through there? That's where I was trying to go, it's still... Can you duck? Uh, trying to jump. <laughs> I love the way you wiggle like, as you're trying to accomplish things. Like you're okay, in some I moved that car VR and I moved situation. it into my way. And now I can't like move it out of my way. Bloodlines. Okay, no. We gotta think here. No, yes. I mean, yes, but... Those, those barrels disappeared. I feel like I was supposed to jump on top of those barrels. That's asking a lot, I think, of coming into a brand new area. Okay. Tempted just to clip you through the car. Are you sure you can't crouch under it? That looks like a really oh, big crouch. space. Ha ha! You remember like that, I said, that power we had? <laughs> I thought you said jump. The noblest under it. of the vampire. Oh gosh! Ah! Someone's throwing things this at guy me. Got hit by a beetle. But you're okay. Ah! Uh, can you just? Can you just? Can you just? Just hop. There you go. Or hover. Hover works too. Ugh. Why is jumping over this so hard? I should be able to just walk through that space. I'm a very skinny little <laughs> vampire lady. Bloodlines! There you go. Just just get a nice running hop through the back of oh, there. Just go ahead. <sighs> Boing. There you there are. Alright, watch out for flying automobiles. Do you think one flew and landed on me? And that's what happened last time? 
Ooh. Not very good at this, sir. <sighs> and my, but in your defense, neither am I. <laughs> Okay, yeah, run, jump. There we go. I don't like that precariously perched. Yeah, green he's, he's gonna throw Corvair. that at me. All right, bring it, bring it. I'm ready. Stop leaning. <laughs> Trying to see around things. Whoa, what was that? Oh no, he set everything on fire. Crap. Vampires are very flammable, you know. Well, how do I get past here? Uh, jump on top of that car? No! It doesn't hurt that much. Just jump Fire? through it. Just jump through it. BBA. Oh, I guess you can just kind of go around it, too. I mean, if you want to be smart about it, sure. Probably worth saving at this point, too. I don't want to get physics again. <laughs> And it's like, oh, I guess I'll just touch this box. Final death. <laughs> it's like, all right. Is he going to throw that at me? So what kind of vampire can teleport and throw cars? I thought it was about all of them, wasn't it? I don't think we can all teleport. Unless he's, like, using celerity to make it look like he's teleporting. Yeah, I wish celerity had that kind of power. Hello. Do I have to crouch to get by? No, I think... Seriously, I cannot walk through this big hole here. <laughs> I mean, the car is slowly moving as you're doing it, so I think the try walking into it and see if you can rotate it and spin it around a little bit. What was that? I was trying to do a running jump thing. There you go, just push it. Uh, there we go, how'd you do it? There we go, come on. <laughs> right, what are you throwing at me next? There's a crane up there. there is. That's gonna be bad news. Mm -hmm. Who is this guy and why is he trying to kill us? And then why are we also. Oh, here? I'm in a cutscene. Oh. You're, oh. <laughs> no! Back off, vampire! Stay the fuck back! I did nothing to you! Aren't you also a vampire? Tell me why you did it! What the hell do you care? I don't give a damn if you understand. Uh, all the same, I'd love to hear your explanation. Please monologue so I live longer. Why? So you can pass judgment on me? Yeah. So you can decide if those murderers deserve to be gutted? You'll never know how it feels, never! Oh, they were murderers? Hmm, he was killing murderers. I'll never know how what feels. Make me understand. Try. Make me understand. My family, my children were butchered by small-time criminals. Just That's looking nice. to rob a house, steal a car, take whatever. No sense to any of it. No plan. No ransom. And so you Just became a vampire. Now you're why? a vigilante. Okay. Because they were there in the way. <sighs> There's probably nothing you could have done. So killing people made you feel better. I mean, obviously, killing people made you feel better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So killing people made you feel better. Not one of them paid. My whole family dead. My life gone. I'm supposed to let that happen? These murders were your revenge? That makes me sound dumb. <laughs> like, obviously they were his revenge. I understand. I tracked them down, hunted them, one by one, caught them all. The one you saw in Hollywood. He was the last of them. Oh, so you're done. And so your revenge is complete. Yeah, you could have been more discreet. But... I You're kind of scary. Blood mission. That's no fun. Yeah, but he he revealed kindred nature. He could have like killed him with a knife instead. You did know. He? I don't think. The, I don't think the. No, he did. Everyone's like, it's a monster. It has claws. Ah. Yeah, he's probably like a gangrel or something. You know. And so your revenge is complete. Revenge, justice, whatever you want to call it. All I thought about is taking these evil animals, ripping them to shreds, and licking their blood from my claws. Sounds tasty. You gave in to the beast inside of you. At least I put it to use. How many vampires have used their abilities for a just cause? At least I did something. You better practice more control or you'll end up answering to the sheriff. I can't turn my back on the evil in this world. Do you think your family would be proud of how you're acting? 
No. Oh, God, no. No. It's got to stop. I can't live like this. You're right. You're right. Oh, God, you're right. I'll never do it again. I swear. Forgive I'm getting me. very forgiving tonight, aren't I? <sighs> All right. Go. Get on with your own life. Wow, I'm just, like, letting killers free left and right. Hmm. Though, he was not the swooshy guy I slashed with my sword. Oh, yeah. I wonder who that was. Who was the swooshy guy? Mysterious. Well, look for the guy with the katana wound. Yeah, sorry I stabbed you, swooshy guy. I thought you were a serial killer. That was very anticlimactic. Like, well, this thing you is, know, like, teasing the serial killer for, what, three chapters? And then it's going to say, yeah, it was me. It was revenge for thing. It's like, well, hey, every, can you not do that anymore? Everybody like, okay. has a tragic backstory. Hmm. Yeah, but it seems mm -hmm. like if you're going to be dealing with an overarching story about a serial killer, you you better do something with no, it. No, it could have been a like bloodbath if I had chosen different role-playing options. Uh, bloodbath meaning it's like you would have murdered him and then it would have been all like, okay, well that's over. Now you must pay! With, you know. I, I'm brother. just, I'm not that kind of vampire. Okay. That's not, that's not the game I'm playing. Not a very good vampire. I'm not. Well, I mean, you, you eat the occasional person. That's kind of cool, but... I like eating people. Carnival of Death. He successfully convinced the serial killer to give up his quest for vengeance now that the killers of his family are all dead. I mean, to be honest, that probably didn't take a lot of convincing. It's like, hey, your vendetta is dead. How about not killing anymore? It's like, well, well yeah. It's like, oh, yeah, yeah, you're totally talking me out of it. Whew. Yeah, Thank but even at along. the end, he was like, oh, you're right, you're right. And I was like, yeah, duh. Did it's, we already cover this? Yeah. It's like, you already killed all the people you needed to kill. And now he's got a taste for it. Now he's going to be Batman and start going off after other people. That's it. Go for it. Have fun. You are playing a very different vampire than I am. No, I'm, just, I'm speaking as me. It's like, yeah, okay. <laughs> if you ever became a vampire, I'd be scared of you. <laughs> it's probably just because I've been sick for a couple of days and I'm still crabby. Kill them all, I say. All Until right. I get a good nap, then everybody's okay, I guess. Let's see. Got 14 experience points. Um, hmm. We need more persuasion. It's expensive. Well, we got our scholarship way up there. How much for another point of charisma? 12. You can do that. I do like being persuasive. Seems to work, but seduction is fun too. Didn't we want to raise our seduction? Nah. Stealth is only six. Melee, we could go go hard on melee. We could get, oh, not not quite enough for more celerity, but we just did celerity, so. Okay, let's do charisma. Yeah. We're gonna be the most persuasive vampire. I mean, we're already talking killers and like. Make sure you hit it except first, otherwise we won't see it. There you go. Everyone no, out of their. So you want to go to the gargoyles now? Um, is there anything else that we need to do in Santa Monica? So this quest here is... That's in the very beginning. Well, that's the blood bank guy. Yeah, that he's I like, I need a new donor. Because he's weird. I don't like him. But um, everyone's saying we're going to need lots of blood packs before we go on this Nosferatu tape mission. Need a ride. That... Don't we have like 30 of them right now? Well, we wasted one of the Elder Vitae ones. We were oh. like, let's see what this does. And then we wasted it. You fool. Yeah. Should have saved that. What's 609 Kingsway? Is that old? No, that's the Nosferatu. That's the boss mission. Oh, got it. So we want to do everything else before that. Though someone did say we don't have to do the graveyard mission before that. Um, we could do it after. Well, I might as well do all the small stuff. I think we get more XP. We could invest more. All right, so we'll first let's go tell Vivi that we solved her problem. We totally did. <laughs> yeah, he he's gone. I I got rid of him. And I'm so just... could you be less vague, please? I could lie. I'm not above lying. I'll just say I killed him. All right. Up to the vip room. Hello, friend. Look who's back. Fifi. Couldn't stay away, could you? No. 
about Hatter, mm -hmm. I found out the name of his source. Are they? I mean, did you? It's taken care of. It must have been difficult. But take some comfort in knowing if you hadn't, someone else would have had to. <laughs> I do appreciate your help. A lot. How much do you appreciate it? Can't you tell? I simply adore you. You do? You're so sweet to me. The way you protect me. Aww. What would I have done had you never come in here? Oh, why can't they all be like you? The world could be so I know, I am so, so nice. <laughs> here, take this. A reminder of the beautiful girl whose heart Can you she stole. be my girlfriend? I'm pretty sure she gets like a whole wallet full of these. She just gives these out to everybody. She's like, oh yes, yes, you're the only one for me. My pleasure, thanks. No, I'm not special to you. Is that it? Are we done? Let's see this autographed photo. Oh, it's a pretty photo. I may be delivering a memento of moi to your haven computer, but this should tide you over for now. Hmm. We can go check our email, I guess. I don't see the autograph on there. I feel shy Oops. You're right. There is no autograph on there. It's on the front. I don't see it. Hmm. And... So... Our humanity is full and our masquerade is full. Was it full before? Mm-hmm. It was already full. But now it's really full. So full. Who is this shady character? Someone who belongs in a strip club. Oof. Alright, so there's a quest we could do in the asp hole. Or we could go do the gargoyle thing. Uh, I vote on gargoyles. Hmm. Because the building is neat. It's true, we haven't gotten to see it yet. I like this area because it's easy to navigate. It's just yeah, one it's just straight line. <laughs> Not like the other areas where we're like, we're lost already. Uh, especially like downtown. We've been there for like months and months and months and every time we're just like, no idea where I'm going. Because we only play once a month, but once we decide to start streaming, um, and I do want to stream on YouTube, not Twitch. Though if I start doing it on YouTube and change my mind, we could switch over to sw Twitch. Switch to Twitch. There is a way to put Twitch videos on YouTube after, so I would still do the thing. Yeah, but YouTube's better. I am all. Wow. Pretty. Am I okay, seeing things in slow motion, or do you have, like, levitating? <laughs> Kindred invader, monster, I will smash you, crush you, tear the flesh from your bones. Please do not. <sighs> I'm here to be friends with you. Hold on. I'm not here to fight you. I just want to talk. Talk? No. Always kindred are talking, scheming, hurting others with their lies. That is true. Monsters, you all, abominations. Hey. Says the giant hot kettle, please. Uh, wait. Hmm, do I want to mention Isaac? I definitely don't want to mention Strauss. Because I feel like that would not go well. Because he probably has a grudge. Um, wait, I come here in peace. I have an offer from Isaac Abrams. <laughs> offer? What offer? Yet another lie. He hopes to control me, to enslave me, just as my master before him. Probably. First he sends his underlings to destroy me, and now he wants to make peace. No! Curse him! Curse you all! <laughs> Hmm, believe me, he doesn't want to control you. He said he needs your protection. What is this? 
Another devilish trick. Am I to trade one chain for another? Bow to Abrams now, instead of my old master? Never! <laughs> Does that mean it didn't work, or...? Hmm... It's either two or three. Which do you think will work? Hmm... Two, I guess. Especially since it mentioned specifically he's not looking for a servant. Yeah. Isaac doesn't need another servant. He needs an ally against his Camarilla foes. Camarilla. I said Camarilla. What means this, Camarilla? Uh, history lesson time? Hmm. They are the kindred who want to rule over other kindred. Isaac fights against them. <laughs> he fights. Fights against his own kind? Yeah. Yes, he fights against those who made you a slave as well. Dot, dot, dot. The Tremere. These other options are terrible. Yeah. <laughs> the Tremere. Hate them above all your kind I do. Secrecy and sorcery. Betrayal and blood magic. Damn to hell are all of you. But the Tremere, most of all. Yes, I am not a Tremere, thank goodness. Imagine if I was a Tremere. Oh, no. It's like, oh, yeah, that's Tremere. Ooh. Uh, I guess it's got to be number two. Yes, Isaac needs your help to eradicate their curse once and for all. I'm just making this up as I go along here. Yes, I will fight alongside this Abrams. And help him in his battle against this... Oh, LaCroix is gonna kill me! Lifeless demon he may be, but I swear to fight at his side. Uh, Good to hear it. I'll tell Isaac he has a new ally. Yes. Now leave me. Oh, I want to look around. This theater is my domain, and I seek the peace of solitude. I want to be your friend, too. Can I have a hug? Something? No? See ya. Oh, I thought it was going to be like a big long thing to get to where he was. And he's just like right in the opening. He's like, yay. Well, he came came in through that. I know, that's your domain, man. Why would you mess it up yeah, so much well, just why for the you expense mess up your of making domain. a cool entrance? Yeah, he had to Which do was like a cool entrance. superhero landing. Yeah. Well, well, that's over. <sighs> I was so sure I was going to pick the wrong answer. But you know, I'm an ice vampire and that gargoyle saw it. See? See, mm. I've been honing my, my diplomacy skills here. Sharpening your skills instead of sharpening your teeth. I, I think it's the fact that we put the extra point to persuasion. It sounds like the persuasion didn't work, though. No, I think those dialogue options wouldn't have been there without that point. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Um, where's Isaac's shop? Like I think it's around the other side. No, no. Is it? No, uh, you're right. Pity me. Around the left there, down the alleyway. I was just looking at the sign. Jeez, Isaac, get someone in, out here to like cover up your building. You're supposed to be the classy joint. He's an anarch. You don't care. I like street art. Hey, so that was tense. You head to King's Way yet? Uh, about the gargoyle, I've convinced it to be loyal to you. A gargoyle serving in the defense of Hollywood. <laughs> Exceptional. I know, right? I am I'm awesome. I'm sure it'll come as quite a surprise to the first shock troop that crosses the city it's line. It's a shock troop? You've got a lot of promise. It's a shame you're still working full-time for the wrong Clearly side. I'm not. Clearly I'm working part-time for both sides. Uh, I've got nothing against the Anarchs. I'd like to hope so. Well, if you'll excuse me. Uh, I've learned something about the gargoyle. Should I tell him? Sure. Yes? I got another masquerade redemption. Hmm, the gargoyle was cremated by the Tremere Regent. He lost control of it. Hmm, didn't I promise not to tell anyone? Did you? Yeah, I promised the Tremere Regent not to tell. Should I tell? Do we like the Tremere? Kind of like him. And, yeah, never mind, forget it. 
But I feel like I'm missing out on something interesting if I don't. I feel like yeah. I'm, I'm I'm playing chaotic good now. <laughs> I don't know. I'm I'm still on the prince's side. I'm all for the Camarilla because he gives us apartments. What is he? What is he gonna give us? We already got the apartments. Hmm. We're also like the prince's number one person. So I'm gonna save, and then I'm gonna tell him and see what happens. And if it's I like regret the boy it, just poofs up. It's like, what are you doing? Stop. You are my number one. You head to King's Way yet? I've learned something about the gargoyle. Yes? The gargoyle was cremated by the Tremere Regent. He lost control of it. Are you positive? So, oh, that's where the gargoyle came from. Mm. If something like this got out, it'd be humiliating for him. Why, if the right people found out about this, it'd be all over town by the end of the night. Do I well want that? Well done, Neonate. <sighs> You're welcome, Isaac. Use it well. So what did that do to my quest log? You told Isaac Abrams that you solved this gargoyle problem. No need to tell the Tremere Regent now that you've betrayed him. <laughs> hmm. I don't know if I want to betray him. What do you think? Should I reload? I mean, you've already betrayed him by telling, like, giving the gargoyle over to them, really. Yeah, but the gargoyle was also kind of his baby. I didn't like, want to sure, kill I him. the gargoyle, but I didn't tell him it was yours. <laughs> I'm going to reload. I, I don't like being a... Snitch. I don't think I'm a snitch. Snitches get stitched. Not playing a snitch here. Okay, so there's only two things left we can do. Oh, let's go back and tell the Tremere agent and see what happens then. Okay. If anything, we could reload to right here and just tell Isaac again if we want. Yeah, that's how you play the game. Cheating. Nice. Scream. Stop screaming at me, lady. Scream. Sure. Look at these bunny ghosts. I like them. Dance bunny flay... Fever? fever? Dance bunny fever. Okay. okay. Down. And we can see Heather while we're there and fill up our blood a little bit. Hop in. Sure, why not? Actually... Never mind. Um, I want to go in here and see if there's anything I can buy. Out of my way. It's your favorite chuckle bomb guy. Oh, I think I remember this guy now. Where is he? It's so festive in here. Aw, oh, he's gone. Hola. I'd like the special. Hmm. Should we get some bullets for this? What's that thing at the bottom? King's Way thing. That. Bolts for our flaming oh. crossbow, which is, I've been told, is completely useless. Should we sell it? We could get $83 for it. Yeah. Uh, well, there's a chocolate bomb. I mean, it's silent, which is nice. Uh, I'm going to sell it. All right. I mean, good stuff. All oh, food should have, like, a creamy center and a colorful candy these. shell, and their commercial should have, like, Kung Fu or Giraffe. Should I sell my Colt? I thought I already sold the Colt. I mean, you pick them up all the time anyway. But you can only carry one, which is 61, weird. 61, Wait, I have two Colts. This is the good one, right? 15 more cents and you're going in my stomach, Jocko Bombs. The Glock is good. I right. missed him. I'm going to sell this. All right. So I need 44, 9... And shotgun shells. Let's see what he's got. They should like 44. combine pizza and nachos together and call them Piznachios. Man, I could go for some Piznachios shotgun right cells. now. Sure. Oh, my ammo's full. What do you do with your life back there, my friend? You just like butter. wander around this convenience store chocolate amusing syrup yourself? Chocolate or peanut butter. Dude, I have to dip these potato chips in something. How much can I buy? Like the other one, I, I I got it full. How much? How much more could I possibly buy? Max. You have forty-five of the other, sixty-six of that one. But what how should... often do you actually use guns? Yeah, it seems well, I I'm going into all like a boss fight, right? That's what I feel like I'm gonna need. Big video game, and we are all characters in should it. Should I get some nine millimeter? Oh, that's like cheap, sure. man. Why not? I got so much money. Whatever. 
Hope I don't regret spending all that money on gun ammo. He's your best friend, look. Look at him. Join in my stomach, Choco Bombs. I wish we could just give him 15 Shops cents so we can get his Choco Bombs. Like, yeah, I got like $2,000. Moth Mothers. Hamburger cereal. It. Or is it supposed to be extra? It's just hamburger helper, but now it's just like hamburger. Deep, man. Whoa, did she just like kick that door? I think for I no just reason? saw her do like a roundhouse kick or something. Okay. That was interesting. Bloodlines. Going somewhere. Downtown. Going downtown. Should I see LaCroix? Is there any reason to see him? Not really. Okay. Let's go tell Strauss. And then let's go see Heather. Let's look at a map so we don't get lost. Jeez, where's the doorman to clean my doors? That's what doormen do, right? Oh, naturally. Check my email and see what VB sent me. What do you think it is? Uh, well, I mean, it can't be a picture because it's like a, you know, like text only ASCII or something, so. It'd probably be something like mildly raunchy in text format. You think she's gonna pay me with something sexual? I doubt it. Hey, babe, what's up, master? Ah, uh, I need your blood. Oh, she's already half empty. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, never mind. She's fine. Please don't die. You still want to change her appearance again? Yeah, let's see what her Look, options are. Look, I can are. see through her shirt. It's like made of plastic. All right. Oh, I don't think I can talk to her. Oh, no, she's too <laughs> out of it. Oops. Oops. Can I throw a glass at her? All right, let's check the email. Oh, did she leave the TV on? I hate it when people leave the TV on. What is he talking about? Are there any scientists out there listening to this? Is zero on red emails, though? Mm -hmm. I don't know where. All right. Do you know the average person eats several pounds of insects a year? Oh, he's a bug eater. Do I need anything out of my chest? Do I want to put anything into my chest? Okay. I'm going to give this to my chest. Can I, should I keep my photo on me or should I nah, put it in the chest? I can't imagine there's a reason to. Hmm. Oh, I should have sold What's this to the guy. This thing down here with the hook symbol on it. Rune of the Third Eye. Oh, haha. Nope. I didn't even need that. Yeah. I'm gonna keep all these important things. Finance ability to read this. Brawl ability to read this. I only have a brawl ability of one. Yeah, just you know, put, you can put all those in them. Oh, those are that is your box. Oh wait, no, it's not. Huh. Okay. Well, at least my blood is full. They said I should have full blood before I go to the King's Way. All right. Uh, I felt like this whole session has been us prepping for this Kingsway thing and putting it off by all possible yes. means. And like, I, like, I really don't want to like, go get on with that. find a bunch of scary, scary Nosferatu type associated things. Um, Strauss's house. Where is Strauss's house? Strauss's house? Yeah, I think Strauss's we gotta go house. completely the other way. I can't remember who Strauss is. He's the guy who made the gargoyle. Is that the one who lives in the maze mansion? Yeah. It was the other way. I know that, but there was a shortcut over here I was trying to but find. But you could see it from where you were, I probably just about, couldn't you? Or was no, that the church? that was the church. Oh. His, his glow's purple. The church glow's red. Silly me. Is that, no, that's not a shortcut. I guess it's like an alley where you could take someone in to eat them. If you wanted to be that guy, the vampire rapist. I'm gonna sell Fat Larry my watch. You know that mission we did for Fat Larry? Oh yeah. That was so Baby pointless. Girl, you know I got what you need. I got a watch for you. Do 
Do you sell blood packs? Ooh, that's an $80 watch. Let's sell this morphine. I will never sell. Ooh, this is valid at $368. I guess if I get desperate, I could sell it. Yeah. I was like, well, first, we don't need money right now, but could yeah, we ever I'm, part with I'm it? I'm keeping a light load here. You're almost maxed out on blood packs. You're fine. No, I'm not maxed out on blood packs. You have 7 out of 10. You can only carry 10. Yeah, I want 10. It doesn't look like he sells them, though. I think the only place I can buy blood packs is from that guy who won't sell them to me because I got rid of his donor. And now I have to get him another donor. And I'm not going to consign some poor wench to that. I'm not that guy. I just don't think I could do the replanting a lily mission. Am I, like, totally foolish? Well, my guy's kind of a jerk, and I didn't do it either. Nope. I'm just going all the wrong ways. Like, people in the comments are tell still telling me, Oh yeah, go do the replanting a lily mission, then you can buy blood packs. I'm like, but the moral ramifications! I cannot, I cannot, I simply cannot. Um, we are starting to wind up here, I think. So I'm gonna talk while I walk. Uh, what do we need to do left before we go to Kingsway? We got a little bit of XP. Should we spend it on something? Um, anything else we anything need to... Anything we need to buy in XP is going to be really expensive. So it's going to be a no, while No, there's a few little things that we just don't have yet. I'm doing this all wrong, aren't I? There we go. Um, so there might be something Hello, we can do. Hello, Neonate. How can I be of assistance? <sighs> Do you have a few minutes to talk with me? Of course. I resolved the issue with the gargoyle, Strauss. You did? That's quite an accomplishment for one so young, Neonate. You have to be so and condescending. With discretion as well. Again, you impress me. Do I? Just doing what I feel is right. And your efforts are well appreciated. Please accept this gift as payment Ooh, for your Ooh, see, he gave me a gift. Isaac didn't give me a gift. The appreciates your confidentiality. Oh, a fate charm. See? See? What? I was on the side of the camera. Yeah. Right? Not being a snitch is the right way to go. Why'd you say CC? Um, because I, I, I betrayed I him and then side. you're like, you already betrayed him, uh, so. Yeah. Uh, no problem. One more thing. Of course. Uh, I have a few questions for you. What is it you would like to know? Didn't I already ask him these questions? Yeah. All right, nothing right now. Goodbye. All right, so what is this thing he gave me? Yes, that. This thing? These things are also creepy. Oh, it's like a little bird skull on a plus one dex. Dex. Neat. This grim totem makes you feel light as a bird. So Great because if you the saw armor out, he would never give you that. The armor we're wearing right now makes us lose one dex. Really? Yeah. So if we need to do something really dexterous, we're supposed to change our clothes. That's. Did I, you know that? No, I thought I figured it was just armor. Nope, it makes us lose our dex, which is realistic. Because it you was know? heavy. Yeah. Oh, but it's just a fur. Okay. I found it in one shot. Look at you. I am. I'm getting the hang of this bloodlines thing. Hmm. All right. So coming up on an hour here. Go back to Hollywood. Um, I'm not going to do replanting a lily. Is there any other way to get blood packs without doing that? If not, am I ready to go to King's Way? If not, what else should I do first? Did I make any really dumb decisions that you're, like, smacking your forehead at me about? Are you talking to me or them? I'm talking to them. <laughs> Who cares about you? Oh, oh, I went the wrong way, but since I'm here, should I talk to Jake the Pirate? Yeah, I don't have anything to say, but oh, it's nice to you see him. You never know. Again. Sometimes he comes out with interesting things. Let's Wait, didn't he disappear? He, or was no. that Nines? Nines disappeared. Let's see what's going on with him. Hey, kid, what's going on? Uh, nope, nothing. No options. Anything I can talk to Sculpture about? What the hell do you want? Oh, nothing. Goodbye. I would like to find Nines again, though. I miss him, even though he doesn't like me. He's still, he's still my friend. My heart will never, never stray. 
I think in my game, Nines is still a buddy. But I think it's been a while. But now that we're this far along, I think I can, I can play him for a while. Play Nines? No, my, uh, my character. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can catch up to me. So is there anything Paul as a gangrel should do that I haven't done that would be more interesting if he does between where yeah, the game he's goes really fast off and now? I just rip off everything's face. I just go into the, like, that feral mode and just everything dies. You let the beast take over? No, I don't let the beast take over. I am the beast. I am the one who knocks. The whole point of the Toreador... Um... Where to, indeed. I was going to go back to Hollywood, but now I'm guessing King's Way is the way to go. Um, so I'm going to leave it here. And have... Oh, this is, let's see what King's Way looks like. I'm curious. No, because once we're there, we can't get out. Oh, okay. If yeah. you say so. Um, anything else we need to do before we go to King's Way? We haven't done the graveyard mission yet. Should we really do that? Get the XP and then spend that XP on something? Um, let's see... We have 7 XP, we could spend it on Brawl and then read the book and then get more Brawl from that. Not that we ever really use fisticuffs, but Brawl affects... No, you've chosen your specialization. You're, yeah, you're but melee if we sure. if we read get one more point in Brawl, then we can read that book. You're a stealth melee... You're, you're a thief class. We spend something in finance, then we can read that book. Um got seven. Should we save them up for something else? Should we spend them in Auspex? There's like one person in the comment who keeps being like, buy Auspex, buy Auspex, but like, not many other people are mentioning it. So. I mean, it'd be good if you're like stealthing around, like if you have Auspex like two Yeah, you can see through the walls, you can see auras, you can see in the dark, but what do we need for what we're going up against now? Don't think about the future, think about now. Are we set for now? Should we save this for something later? Or do we need something that will really help us with this... I don't think one point of anything is going to make a difference. Snuff point. It might. Could. Yeah. <laughs> Those are my questions. Do you have any questions? Nope. I'm, I'm satisfied. All right. Well, until next time. Good night. Blah? You can do a better blur than that. Blah. Meh. Oh, you know how you did that blah for my text noise in my last video? Mm -hmm. Everyone says they want that text noise. Oh, give it to them. Upload it. You, so you have it on your hard drive somewhere. But it's just you going blah. Exactly. You could, you could do it right now and they could take it. Blah? But now it's all mixed into the background music so they can't. Oh. If anybody actually wants the text noise, if you're even still listening to us right now... <laughs> It's like hanging off for like the like the post credit sequence. He's like, what more could they possibly say? Bye. I know. I already said goodnight. What else is there? Blah. Blah.